Isn't he lovely? I, w I told you. So. Uh, the first time we really met was at this rehearsal and I got out of the car in the pouring rain. I fell flat onto the pavement with my cello. So I came into the rehearsal soaking wet. And then this person came and was really polite and friendly. Oh, it's not was like I his running? reputation. Yeah, you were very nice I brought him day. a little blankie. Oh, you no, you were very sweet. You sort of out. said, hi, I'm Richard. You know, it's so sweet. How times change, how times change. Yeah, the ACO has this very special energy, this very special enthusiasm and openness. You know, as a group with an individual personality, and that's great. That's so exciting to play with them. But this piece is perfectly suited for our expanded mm -hmm. size because it still remains a chamber concerto. This piece, the Fifth Symphony and, and the Eighth String Quartet are monumental works that really typify the tragic notion of Shostakovich. But one thing for sure is that he does, in a Mahlerian way, pit the tragic against the grotesque to highlight the, the tragic. No better do we find this, I think, than in the slow movement when the cello mm. is playing the most extraordinary melody and we get an umpa sort of folk band. Well, no, I think there's a reason for that. That theme is sort of is meant to be slightly comic or innocent. It, the point is, is where it starts with this umpa band and it's sort of very innocent and childlike. And then within about 16 bars, it is grotesque. Mm. It is evil. It's been distorted and stretched. It anyway, it's very cin cinematic music. It's thrilling yeah. to play and hopefully to listen to. But Ross Roach also confirmed to me that he learned it from memory in four days. Mm. Incredible stuff. Because uh, uh, I thought he learned it in one day. And he said, no, four days. And I said, but Hindemith in one night. Yes, Hindemith in one night. Did you ask Rostropovich about the quote? He described Shostakovich as, um, I think it was this concerto, that it was musical hooliganism. Oh, really? <laughs> Nach <laughs> on that note, <laughs> go on. you got please. a rehearsal. Yeah. I don't. <laughs> um, hey, we've got to practice our encore. <laughs> 